The Software Requirement Specification (SRS) is a critical document in the software development process. It serves as a bridge between stakeholders' expectations and the technical aspects of a software project. This comprehensive overview explores the key components, importance, and best practices associated with SRS and software engineering. The Software Requirement Specification (SRS) is a detailed document that precisely defines the functional and non-functional requirements of a software system. It acts as a blueprint for the entire development team, providing a clear understanding of what needs to be developed and how the system should behave. Introduction describes the purpose, scope, and objectives of the SRS document. Overall description offers a high-level view of the software, including its functionality, constraints, and interactions with external entities. Specific requirements details the functional and non-functional requirements, providing a granular understanding of the system's features and constraints. Use Cases describes various scenarios that illustrate how users will interact with the system, helping to understand system behavior from an end-user perspective. Functional Requirements specifies the functions the software should perform, including inputs, processes, outputs, and interactions with users and external systems. Non-functional requirements encompasses aspects like performance, security, usability, and reliability, defining how the system should behave rather than what it should do. Performance requirements details criteria related to response time, throughput, and resource utilization to ensure the system meets performance expectations. Design constraints outlines any limitations or restrictions on design. Choices, such as specific technologies, tools, or standards to be used. External interface requirements describes how the software will interact with external entities, including hardware, software, and users. Importance of SRS shared understanding ensures that all stakeholders have a common understanding of the software's functionality and constraints. Basis for development serves as a foundation for software development, guiding the design, coding, and testing phases. Scope management helps in defining and managing the project scope, preventing scope creep and ensuring project alignment with business goals. Basis for testing forms the basis for creating test cases, enabling comprehensive testing to ensure that the software meets specified requirements. Best practices for SRS development collaborative approach involve all relevant stakeholders, including users, developers, and business analysts in the creation and review of the SRS. Clear and concise language use clear and precise language to avoid ambiguity. Ambiguous requirements can lead to misunderstandings and project delays. Version control implement version control to track changes, updates, and revisions to the SRS. This helps maintain document integrity and facilitates collaboration. Traceability matrix establish traceability matrices to link requirements. Back to their sources, ensuring that each requirement is traceable throughout the development process. Validation and verification regularly validate the SRS with stakeholders to ensure alignment with evolving project needs. Verification involves checking that each requirement is well-defined and testable. The software requirement specification is a fundamental document that lays the groundwork for successful software development. Its clarity, precision, and alignment with stakeholder expectations contribute significantly to the overall success of a software project. By following best practices in SRS development, software engineering teams can enhance collaboration, minimize misunderstandings, and deliver software products that meet or exceed expectations.